Hey you guys, um, I hope y'all enjoyed this video. Um, I wouldn't be able to make it without the help of the groomsmen and the bridesmaids. And y'all are just so awesome for helping me put this together. Um, Brittany and Peyton, I hope y'all enjoy these messages from all your sweet people in your wedding party. They've been really nice and sweet to work with. And I hope y'all enjoy this video. Bye. Hey Bill, just catching up on the latest Bassmaster. A boost of morale, if you will. I'm a little bit down with the news that I'm gonna lose my fishing partner, my hunting buddy. You're on to greener pastures. You got your new beautiful wife, and I'll be stuck ripping lips on old greenbacks and cashing checks while you're doing honeydews. But on a serious note, we're happy for you guys. We're excited, you know, I love the fact that I know anytime I call my old cuz, he's going to drop everything and answer the phone, and we're probably going to talk fishing for 30 minutes or an hour, most of the time an hour, but we're excited for you guys and we're happy for you, so best of luck, and we love you guys. What you been doing? I've been looking for you for an hour. Uh huh? They're sitting out here with the chickens. Think about the good old days. Me and Peyton used to wash these things together and take them to shows and all that, but I guess now that's over with. Brittany's done, done took him from me. I don't know if I can handle it, but I guess I'll just have to manage somehow. But I guess I can say this. Congratulations and best wishes to y'all from Blue Run and Dooley family. I'll get back to the chickens now. Hey Peyton, seems like yesterday we were big stars opening up for Sammy Kershaw and Heflin. Guess I'm gonna have to miss my jam session partner now that she'll out be doing honeydews for Brittany. Then again, it does take a special woman to love a bull riding, cage fighting ginger that loves the sound of Freddie Mercury and Elton John. Uh, seriously, buddy, I'm real proud of you, and thanks for letting me be a part of y'all's big day, and hope for many, many, many years of happiness, man. I love y'all. Just wanted to congratulate you on your big day and tell you that it was awesome being able to be a part of it and stand up there with you. I want you to know that I love you, and I hope the best for you, and I pray the best for you. And as for you, Brittany, I didn't just gain a sister-in-law. I gained a sister. I love y'all so much and wish the absolute best for you. Hey Peyton, just wanted to uh, send you this message. I know they've been kind of wanting me to hurry up, but it's just hard to do when you got so many good things you can say about somebody. Uh, but but uh, just, I'd be reserved to say your mom and I are just blessed to have four beautiful children and now four beautiful in-laws that uh, we're so proud of and we don't call them in-laws, they're family. But today's your day, Peyton, so I just wanted to, to send this message to you, but I, I can't help but tell Peyton's been one that's always said what's on his mind when it was on his mind. Uh, well, just a story one quick day that we he and I were deer hunting. I looked down at him. We were sitting in a stand. He's just a little old boy. Couldn't shut him up hardly. So one day he was kind of being quiet. So I looked down at him. And when I did, he was looking straight at me. And he said, hey, Dad, did you know one side of your nose is bigger than the other? And I said, what, boy? He said, yeah, one side of your nose is bigger than the other. And I said, Peyton, you need to watch for deer. Don't worry about one side of my nose or the other. So he turned around and started looking at the, the deer again. A few minutes later, I looked down. He was looking at me again. I said, what, boy? And he said, Dad, did you know one side of your ears is lower than the other? I said, man, you need to start looking for deer, not looking worried about one of my ears or not. So Peyton's always been one that says what's on his mind. But just wanted to say today, Peyton, uh, you, my mom, your mom and I are just so, so proud of you, what you become, the man you become. Uh, Dad couldn't wish any more for a son like you, great morals, great worth ethics, truthful, dedicated, just a, a wonderful individual, very faithful to his Lord. 
uh, we're just so proud to have you and uh, just wanted to say I, I hope this is a wonderful day for you. I know it is for us. Just proud to be a part of it. Uh, and on behalf of Brittany, uh, good Lord, we just couldn't ask for somebody like, else like Brittany. We're just fortunate to have two wonderful family that daughters that have married our sons as well as two good son-in-laws. But just, just wanted to say, Brittany, we are so proud of you. We're, we're, you're a wonderful young lady. Uh, you're a Christ-filled woman, and, and we're just so proud to have. We know that you and Peyton are going to have a wonderful life as long as you keep and turn things to the Lord and put it over to the Lord and trust the Lord. Both of you will uh, be wonderful people in our communities, and we're just wonderful to have you, Brittany, as part of our family. Uh, again, uh, the best of the day. Hope God blesses you for, for the rest of your life. Uh, great day. Talk to you later, buddy. See ya. Hey, guys. Brittany, I'm so honored to have stood by your side not only today but through this whole journey. We've had so much fun, and it all worked out beautifully. I'll admit at first I was really excited to have someone join in this family who is shorter than me and a pickier eater than me. But now I'm just so happy for us to officially become the sisters that we've been all these years. Peyton, you could not have picked anyone better than Brittany to join our family, to love you, to be with you. We are so happy for you guys. We wish you all the happiness in the world. We love you guys. Bye. Hey, Britt. Can't believe the big day's here. I just wanted to tell you congratulations and that I love you. You're one of the most amazing people I know, and you deserve a lifetime of happiness, and I know that's exactly what Peyton's going to give you. I love you, girl. Hey, Brittany and Peyton. Um, I just wanted to say that I am so happy for y'all um, and so excited for your marriage and for your wedding. And Brittany, I just wanted to say that I am so, so grateful for our friendship. Um, that started at good old Louisiana College. Um, I just, I love you so much and I just love how from day one of meeting one another randomly in the staircase at um, Cottingham Hall that it's like we were friends instantaneously and just hit it off and um, I'm just so grateful for you because since then you have been one of my most um, dependable, stable, solid, just one of my most amazing friends and I am so so grateful for that um, I like that through every single important milestone through our adult lives we have been there for one another and have walked through it together and I'm so grateful that you asked me to participate um, in this milestone where you marry Peyton finally um, I'm just so happy for y'all and I just want to wish you um, a very happy rest of your lives Hey you guys, um, I just wanted to drop by and tell you how happy I am for the both of you. Um, Brittany, I've known you for, well, forever practically. Um, I consider you to be more of a sister. Peyton, you. Let's just start out with you. Um, I don't know if you remember this or not, but it was one of Frylo's birthday parties. There was a horse involved. And this horse... Well, its saddle wasn't on like it was supposed to be. Well, all these people had been riding this horse. Well, it got to be my turn. Well, who is the one lucky person who fell off this horse in front of everybody? That would have been me. Thanks to you, Peyton. Thanks to you. The saddle was too loose. Fell completely underneath the horse and fell off in front of everybody. So, thank you for that. But I guess I'm past that now and just wanted to say how happy I am for the both of you and I wish you a lifetime of happiness and forever and ever and ever. What up, Felicia? <laughs> um, <laughs> Peyton, it's been great having you in my life and I'm so glad that you've treated me like a sister through all these years and I'm so glad that you gave me the privilege to keep this secret for so long that you were going to propose to my sister, but I'm so glad you did, and I'm so glad, so glad, I'm so glad you finally proposed to her after months of planning, like me and you had a whole bunch of plans going on and you didn't listen to any of them, but it's okay, it all worked out good and I'm so glad that it did. Um, 
I'm so thankful for everything that you've done for me, and you're just so amazing, and I'm so glad that my sister has you. Um, I could say a million things, but I'm going to stop because this video would be forever long if I kept rambling about you, but it's been great having you and my family, and I'm so glad that you're finally officially becoming a part of it. It's been awesome. Bye. Sister, sister. Um, <laughs> Brittany, I'm so glad that God made you my big sister. Um, I would be completely lost without you. Like, completely, completely lost. Um, you're my life coach and my role model, and you're my number one fan in everything that I do. And I, j I can't imagine having anybody else. Um, I love you so much, and you're like a second mom to me, and you've seen me grow, and I've seen you grow, and it's just been so awesome. Um, thank you for all that you've done for me, and for always letting me sleep on your couch when I need somewhere to sleep. Um, you're so amazing, and you're so humble, and you're so perfect, and I strive to be like you every single day, but... Then again, I'm so glad that we're completely opposite because we work so well together that way. Um, again, with you two, I can go on forever and ever and ever, but uh, people will get tired of watching this video, which they may already be, but it's okay because it's almost over. Um, I really hope you like this video, and I hope you aren't too disappointed that I didn't give you a speech, but you too both know that I really don't do that stuff and I would get there and I would just talk and 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 awkwardly stand there and awkwardly laugh like I am here on camera but it's okay because I'm not standing up in front of people um I'm so glad I'm so glad that the day's finally here and it's finally over and I'm so glad that you picked me to stand by your side um, it's been a lot of hard work and a lot of stress, and that's why I look a little crazy right now because I'm just a little bit stressed out, but it's all been worth it, and it's all awesome. It's all going to be awesome, and the wedding was awesome, I'm sure, and everything's just going to work out cool, like awesome. <laughs> Man, I said awesome a lot. Uh, well, today's finally here, and it's finally over, and I love you so much, and I love both of y'all so much, and I'm so glad that y'all picked each other to be with forever and I'm so glad. Walk up here a little closer. There you go. Let me know Okay, before this video completely ends, I would like to give a huge, huge, huge thank you to all the groomsmen and all the bridesmaids who helped out with making this video. Um, thank you so much. Thank you, Heather, for getting all the guys for me. And thank you, Jamie, for finally getting Nick's. Um, thank you, bridesmaids, for sending me your videos and giving me all these great ideas for everything. It's been so great getting to, like, bond with all, all y'all and everything. It's been so fun. Um, I'm so glad this wedding has brought all of us together. And this has just been so much fun being with all y'all. Um, thanks again. I can't thank y'all enough for this. And I'm sure Brittany and Peyton can't thank y'all enough either. Um, that's it. We're done. <laughs>